Hello, my name is X-Ray, and I review weekly free games on the Epic Games Store. This week, Epic Games has made two items free this week, Chess wow. Ultra and a World of Warship Starter Pack. As a fan of board games, I was intrigued, mm. but seeing how this has played out for other board games turned into video games, well, I had my doubts. Upon first opening the game, I was met with this screen. I'm not sure why I need Steam mm. to play the multiplayer online portion, but because I don't want to pay money, I skip this step. Whether you've played just before or are brand new to the game, there's a tutorial section that allows you to learn the piece names, how they move, and even test out a few basic plays. Beyond these tutorials are little lesser known rules like how to castle and on passant, and after that are a few different openings. This brings me to my first criticism hmm. about this game. If you understand how PC games work and you've played chess before, the beginning tutorials are too basic. However, if you're experienced in chess to the point that you can memorize an opening based on th these tutorials, you definitely don't need the guides. Moving forward, the next area of this game that I explored was the challenges menu. I was particularly interested in the challenges that made you try to get checkmate in a certain number of moves because I haven't seen this in any of the other free chess games that I've played in the past. If you find these too easy or if you want to experience chess matches from the greats of chess history, I recommend you check out the historic portions on the challenge menu. After trying out these challenges, I had to try my hand at single player matches. I appreciate the amount of graphics work that has been put into this game, and I'm really impressed not only by the environments that you can play in, but also how the soundtrack matches the atmosphere. Just take a listen at the different themes you can hear. That being said, I overall found myself bored with this game. Perhaps that's me discovering that I like the social aspects of board games more than the actual board games themselves, or maybe that means I don't recommend downloading this title. If you decide that you'd like to try these puzzles or want to experience the parts of the game that I haven't showcased, Chess Ultra is free on the Epic Game Store from now until March 30th at 10 o'clock central time. Because of this game's scenic environments and historic gameplay, I give this game a rating of 7 out of 10. If you enjoyed this review of Chess Ultra, leave a comment or join my Discord. I'd love to talk to you about this game or the other one that I've linked here. You may already have this game in your library. Thanks for watching.